Ha mudikiria ko ai mega ho ai ne mega. De da ko ga idia. De no ari tore ya moda and praise God. I would like to extend my greeting to you and to say welcome to this program and that we pray together and we worship and we have this serial reading tonight as we go to rest. Welcome one, welcome all. Let us pray. Father in Jesus name. We want to come to you this night that you talk to us. We reason to you while we expound the love that you extended to us while we were yet seeing us. Talk to us. Touch our heart. Prepare us for your second coming. May we be able to see and reflect your love to others as we live in this world while we are waiting for your second coming. This is my humble prayer. Talk to us through your Holy Spirit in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you. I pray that you will be able to hear the word of God. I pray that you will be able to hear the word of God. I pray that you will be able to hear the word
Oh, thank you. God bless you so much. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Hawaii ni mwega mudikiriria wako atirio ndo ngitu gweka otiga kuingira thaini wa Twitter wa mudenya wa mothe. Ah, uh, mudenya wa mothe awengenda tu eruti ohoro wa wega wa ngai, wendo wa ngai. Wendo wa ngai ona niti ona njira nyinge muno makiria. Na mudenya wa mothe tokuona ukiona niyo thaini wa andu alea meta go Babylon, Babylonians and walea mari thaini wa the. This is in accordance with the same same three angels message. To carry your own Amurai Kawakana, the fourth angel of Revelation 18, verses 1 to 4. If you look at Revelation, let's go together. Revelation 18, verses 1 to 4, talks about the great love of God, that God is calling us. He loves us so much that he has even to send a very agent angel with a very strict message, and a message that has to be delivered to his people without fail and without fear and it has to be delivered with an urgency sense of urgency this is it revelation 18 verses 1 to 4 and after these things i saw another angel came down from heaven having great power and earth was lightened with his glory and he cried my tree with a strong voice saying babylon the great is foreign is foreign it has become the habitation of the devil <coughs> and hold of every foul spirit and the case of every unclean and hateful bold. For all nations have drunk the wine of her love and her fornications and her kings of the earth and the kings of the earth have committed fornication with her and the merchant of the earth are waxed rich through the abundance of her delicacies. And I had another voice. This is the key message that I want us to get tonight. And I had another voice. After this explanation of what is happening to Babylon, amidst all that is happening to Babylon, God did something very particular. He had, John had another voice. Is another angel. He had, what did he hear? This is verse 4. And I had another voice from heaven saying come out of her my people that ye be not partakers of her sin and that ye receive not of her plagues this is our message tonight how does god extend his love to his people can you see he has people in babylon they don't know him they don't know what i'm going to preach they don't know many things that we talk about they have not heard about sunday all. they have not heard about that god must be observed but be worshipped in spirit and in truth they have been led to worship god in praises in songs in entertainment no truth and they are happy they are worshiping god they love god and god loves them so much that he says i am going to send another angel just to tell you that worship me worship god who created heaven and earth. This is Revelation 14, verse 6. This is another angel, the first angel. He has the first in gospel. Inciting, inviting us to worship he him cre who created the earth. And op openly, you will know and agree with me, when a name is brought about creation, there is an authority being, ex being shown here. We have to worship he him because there is somebody else being worshipped who did not create, but he claimed, he claimed to create the earth. This other being that is worshipped, we saw this is the kingdom that is ruling the earth. And this kingdom that is ruling the earth is being worshipped through the beast of Revelation 13 verses 1 to 11. And this beast is being worshipped because he has been given power by dragon. We read about this in my previous presentation. So, you see, God's love is still being extended to his people. Because we are And we're going to see that tonight, how God did this in a, what we call object reason. Today we're going to study about the prophet Jonah. When I was young, I saw pictures on the walls of the hotel of somebody being vomited by a fish. And I was told his name was Jonah because he was a rebellious person. And God sent him and he refused to go. 
And so the big fish swallowed him and took him to Nineveh. So I could see him being formatted and the title there was Nineveh. Let me tell you, my, my friend, my brother in Christ, that tonight we are going to study about Jonah. After doing a very extensive study and asking the Holy Spirit to refuse to me, I came to learn about Jonah. He was man of God. He was a type of Jesus. He was living with God. And even though the book of Jonah is only four chapters, it tells us exactly what is going to happen in the last days. For we have to have Jonah today. Jonah must be there. And now Jonah is none other but Elijah. But Elijah was sent to God's people. Elijah was a prophet in Israel during King Ahab. And then Elijah was a prophet in Israel during the birth of Jesus. And he was the forerunner of Jesus Christ when he came the first time. But now, when Jesus came, where did he come? He came to his own people. But his own people did not want him. John chapter 1, goes according to John chapter 1 verses 11 and 12. He came to his own people, but his own people didn't like him. But verse 12 says, all those who believed in him were given authority. They were given power to, to become children of God. It's a very good and a very, very good book because Jonah, we don't know his occupation. We don't know. We don't know. And Jonah, in Jonah chapter 1, verses 1, and it says this, and I like it because. It says, and the word of God came unto Jonah, the son of Amittai, saying, That is the beginning of the book of Jonah. But who is this Jonah? Jesus has mentioned three prophets. Isaiah, Daniel, and Jonah. And even though Jonah, every time I had preached about Jonah, I have seen Jonah as a rebellious prophet. I have had so many sermons about Jonah going down to the belly of the ship. I have had Jonah refusing. But Jonah, Jonah is a very particular prophet right now because Jonah will read God's people. Jonah will call people out of Babylon. And Jonah when we understand the message of Jonah, we are going to understand the love of God extended to the people who are not his people. What is this? Listen to the book of, of Jesus talking about Jonah in, jo in the book of Luke 11, chapter 11, verses 29. What does Jesus say about Jonah? This is what I want us to, 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 to see. My, my friend, my friend, let's see about the book of Jonah. And then we... I, I want you to follow my little, I have few slides here and I would like us to, to see. In the book of Jonah, in the book of uh, Luke chapter 11 verses 29 to that one, it says like this, And when the people were gathered together, he began to say, This is an evil generation. They seek a sign and there shall no sign be given to it, but the sign of Jonah the prophet, for Jonah was signed into Nenevites, so shall also the son of man be to this generation. Listen again, Jesus is quoting Jonah, and I want to read, I want to read again, I want to read again, in the, in the Kikuyu language, and because I want us to hear what Jesus is saying, and Jesus is not condemning Jonah, He's not saying, giving a big sermon about Jonah going to the belly of the fish. Jesus is saying, as Jonah was assigned to the Ninevites, 
So shall be the son of man. Who was Jonah? A son of man. Son of Amitai. That is why he is given name son of a man. So, listen again. Listen again. Listen, listen, listen. Guy, you know, we turn you out to the number and I go to worry you about my mama again. And they get that to my need and not to my men. The Kiria Ugwe. The Kiria Ugwe. Look, it come in name of Mohariwa 29. Nadiria Kiri de Kiamo Ganegerare. A Kirika Kuga Tere. Russia Roro, Russia Roboku. Naruore Daga Kuonio Kemenidia. Nadere, Lotika, Lotigihe, Otiga, Okemenidia, Kiriakia, Jona. You know, Tirikemenidia, Gigiroka. The Gemenidia, Kiriakia, Jona. Tondo Jona, Kiriatia. Nego Koro, Toria, Jona, to a Kirikemenidia, Korea, do Anne Neve. Ogo, not a Gomoro, Moduna, Kiaga, to a Kemenidia, Kore, and to a Russia, Roro. No, Tom, woman. Jona became assigned to the Ninevites. How did it happen? Let me give you a short story of Jonah. Jonah chapter 1 verses 1. Now the word of the Lord came unto Jonah, the son of Amittai, saying, number one, he is a son of man. No other story of Jonah is given. But we, as we go on, we will understand more about Jonah. Arise and go to Nineveh. The great city and cry against it for their wickedness is come up before me. Nito la regiri de kuaganu wa batete yoka koraje hova ba beri be beri. Nito do waganu wa keni okinye teigoro. Okira odi e ba beroni. Omere andu akwa mahumeku. Na we okira jona odi e nineve. What was this city of Nineve? Number one, Nineve was one of the cities that was built by Nimrod, the first king, first rebellious king after the. Anti Deruvian world. In other words, Kuma Bran Hure Kushia Geshiara Nimurodi Nake Nimurodi Agetue Kamore Mimu no Berea Jehovah. Genesis chapter Shigana Tavadari. Genesis chapter 11. Wobo Omahau. Genesis chapter 10. Fazi 8 to 13. Toyado Mamatora Mogo Waja Maria Nimurodi Akire. Seven cities that Nimrod build. Which are those cities that Nimrod built, the seven cities? And also the country that he established that are there today. And these are the form of Babylon. So the capital city or the country that Nimrod started to rule in was Babylon. Then after that, Agiakanineve Itora, which was the capital city of Assyria. Agishoka, Agiaka Ereku, and then he built Ekedu, Kelain, and Shinaru. And then he he built those cities, the big three cities, which was Nineveh, Rehoboth, and Kara, which is Egypt, all misery. And those were great cities that Nimrod established the worship of sun god called Maduk. And this Maduk was the father of Nimrod or of Tamuzu. And uh, Nimrod's wife, which is another story that we have to stand in. Particularly, it is very well matched, very, very well competent in the history of secular history. That the, the, that is where we get the writings of Hammurabi, the code, the rule giver. They were all ruling under the, the, the Maduk, who was the king of Syria, who was the inheritor of Babylon. And that is where we also came to get uh, Nebuchadnezzar. So, my brother, my friend, the worship of Babylonians. About in Makita, Mrs. Induniani, the whole world is in Babylon. That's what the Bible says, you mean me. It started then. And this city of Nineveh was one of the great cities. And so it is still considered as Babylon. And why would God send his, his prophet, Jonah, to Nineveh? Nineveh was not an Israelite city. Nineveh was Babylon. But it came to time that God had to destroy Nineveh. But God's people were still there. We had some Israelite who had moved there. We had people who had lived with Israelite and have been practicing the worship of true God among the Ninevites. And God still loved the Ninevites and these people who has gone there, his people, who were trading with the Ninevites because it was a sea capital, it was the trade route, and God had to do something for the Ninevites before he did. So he sent his prophet. Whom did he say? Did I say? 
his prophet. God sent his prophet. A son of Amitai. And Jonah, you know, the story is very short. He did something. He arose, first, first three, he arose up and free into Tashish from the presence of the Lord. Number one, where people always, we always, we always missed this point. Jonah was in the presence of God. So he left the presence of Lord and then he decided whether to go to Nineveh. He said, no, 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 no. You, you, you must know something, Jesus. These Ninevites don't love you. They don't love me either. They will live and kill me. I don't believe they will listen to me. So I will rise and go to somewhere else. Leave them. They are deserve pure judgment. Was John alone? That's what I will do. That's what you do. That's why we don't even give our money to people we don't like. That's why we don't preach to people we don't like. And that's why we, we sell this gospel. We have to be given money to give the gospel. Because we like to preach to people who love us. We like to preach this is us. And Jonah is coming out of the presence of Gayone Kagaku. What was the presence of Munatawakwa? There was only one place that God was present. If you read in the book of uh, uh, Prophet Ezekiel, verse 8, verse 8, the whole of that, he's saying that they are Pushing me out of my presence in my sanctuary in the temple. Ne tora wa mirio horowa hekaro tora uga atiri hatiri haduha gegayo ne kagati ga hekaro ine de ine. John arauma hekaro ine. The only thing is Jonah was not a Levite. I don't think so. And Jonah was not a priest. So Jonah must had a very close relationship with God <laughs> to come out of the presence of Lord. And he went and boarded that. At, he bought a ticket to Tarshishi and he went to the boat and he went down to the boat. And Jonah is still thinking, what is going on? And there in the boat, Jonah made some preaching. And what did it happen? Then the Lord sent out a great wind into the sea and there was a mighty tempest in the sea and the ship was like to be broken. Revelation chapter 7, verse 1. Four angels are holding weeds so that they may not strive on this earth, on the great waters. Ado, my maruga mereide, ado. Revelation 17, verse 15. Mae mashiona mo maige wona, ne iruka, na meario, na ado. So, Jonah is in the midst of the people, in the world. But he is quite somewhere. Jonah is quite somewhere. He's waiting for Babylon to be finished. God is gonna said something. He is gonna release the weed. The four angels are gonna release the weed. And the strife and the storm is gonna shake. And people will cry unto Jonah. Any sadly go yoka murata wa mwadani. Na sadru yoka ali COVID go yoka. Adwaria marale gete kinya pasta za itwaria to hujagia now. Marale gete kuruta nora di mauga maruta na wedo a Jesu. You know, you know, it has become now gospel. Oh, he can it has gospel. I am a twin. Go tiri, a twin. Go tika. He can you more than you give. I am a toy. Go tiri. He can a twin. We had forfeited. To cut to a car, Jonah. Fully, Jonah. Na to a car, my ine. Na kiongo yonege goka. Yonege go to Maria. Because sure, there will be strife for three days, three years. That's what they are saying to us. Everywhere I reason, our pastors, what Jonah did, Oh, Tauria Muruamu, I carried the 
Jonah ikarirenda ya kiunguyo uthiko hithatu As Jonah was in the belly of the fish Three days and three nights So the son of man Nake muru wa mudu Todo Jesu agikuwa ni muru wa mudu Jesu dawaiti ya lera uga He is son of man Daraku wa ni muru wanga Na ha ha hali Jesu ni ya kuona ni ya The same makinya ma Jonah Tadikiri ya one Jonah li ni ya ikio Dia na kutoka huko muheroga na roa story ni ukubwa majiona mwe. Tado ni mae kumuaya, mama uri yana kile ahuru wakura. No ane kane. No ra, look, mwana ni mitoa kia bohari amote ina ni kigere kwa. Ala ahuru wakura nguo shiake. Neto hule isi tu tinge kwa na ika ahuru wakura. Iko iwe ni mado. Neto hule ikura. Oya ni wewe wewe. Ni yeye tangu wajiona. Wow. The monavi wangai. The kio le kagoko. The guere to di ni nebe karega. Eh, the ure ne 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 to to choki meri meri dege choka. No ginya de di de dege choka na duuda tike go de neka. Ne to choki meri dry dege choka. Meri gai ego di na bere kore ego di atarishi. Jona no wa ote go idia ine. This world is going toward destruction. It's not going to stop, my brother, my sister. And Jona, Jona was to be thrown in the ocean. Now the mark, and then you know what? Jonah was not taken to Nineveh. Take my words. Jonah that word it was Nineveh. God will not force you to start preaching. You have to do it by your money. You have to do it by your Allah. You have to request the Holy Spirit and you have to understand and you have to do the same prayer that Jonah did in the belly. In the Jacob's time of trouble, neginya tohoi hoere ya Jonah. Tere mwana ta wakwa, hatire kigiri ya kikugiri ya tohoi hoere ya Jonah. Ihi inda indiriri ya dhina waja kufu. Ihi inda ya dhina waja kufu, neginya tohoi hoere ya Jonah. Tori ya tiriri, mwana ni, jwiratha, ala uka daka hile ya Jehovah. Dithi ini, dithi ini, waha, daya, akikaya giuri ya mwana ni nika shoka, eee, na maitho makwa negona. Listen, Jonah was the type of Jesus. To Ninevite. He was to come to people who don't love him. Jonah was to preach to people who don't like him. Jonah went through exactly the same agony that Jesus did. Imagine Jonah is coming out of the presence of the Lord. No gewaumire igoro. John 3.16. Todo olea ga yedide kini digea wuko odi. Ato mire muno wake wa mumwe. Negedo olea odi okumu ite kia da kano ole. No waka agea na muwe wa atene na atene. Atene muna ata wakwa. Jona ala uma budi ino angai na ke Jesu ala uma budi ino angai ago okade aga shia ruota kana aga kora herode amwetere ile gatagate ine kando aige makuri ate ino wa Jerusalem aga kora ga ikara kabia kuhuji aga kora u Jona mo Jona mo batidania aga dia ga ikoro karoe Jesus is going down to the river as Jonah was going down to the belly of the... And Jesus too is going down to the belly. He goes to the river. He goes there. Who does this down? He's buried in the river by John the Baptist. And then he's taken 40 days in the wilderness. Na ke Jonah aga ikuruka. Aga ikuruka. Ako aka umaku udhiyo ine wangai. Aga ikuruka adhe kule ya do nineve yaka igira ambrot. Ado inege. Aga ikyo hiria. This is... Amazing. And Jonah, no alea kamadhafu, why am I going? Why am I doing all this? Gai ule niki, gai wakwa, adwa ya hali. Niki, ehe Jonah, no ginya maigwe mugabo, gomani ina maga kuyu. No, no ginyo diyo mere, these are Ninevites. Jonah akauma, kamer yoneda maki, diko idato. A Jonah akahoya, Jonah chapter 2. Jonah. Na digo kwa hiyo radhi wani never to hold, never to hold na hivi, ni nda hivi, is the Babylon, is is falling, is falling, Babylon is falling. You can read na huu muige ni muharibu thirteen, na huu mida tu muharibu wa ikumina kenda, safania na hivi thirteen to fifteen. Ni never is the Babylon of today, is foreign, is foreign, is foreign. The same message. In Jonah chapter three, and the word of Lord, and the word of the Lord came into Jonah, and the second time saying, Arise and go into Nineveh. But before that, let us <laughs> let us read John, Jonah chapter two verse ten. And uh, the word and the Lord spoke unto fish, and it formed Jonah upon a dry land. Did the Bible say 
upon Nineveh? No, the Kerelia, now the Kerelia, now the woman I get away, the woman I get logo. Die Mungua Canena and Samaki, now you let Samaki, Akam Tapika Yona Katika in Chicago. Jonah was formated in the dry land. The dry land is the fish took back Jonah to the land of Israel. Again, Pip. Kira Jonah, the Ure Unewa Kira, Jonah, I can't have the either to Amena Nema. Jonah knew now the love of God. And now Jonah knew exactly. These three days, he did not understand the Son of Man will live under the belly of the earth for three days. But he still go through the same agony as Jonah. The only thing about it is, the difference is that when Jonah came out of this, it didn't dawn to him that he was being a sign to Nineveh, just as Jesus is a sign to us by dying on the cross, by going three days in the grave. Naro shiyaro ro 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 le ti ake ama na kuriya do mare ita anavi na makauga ni mara rada ukuma October woko wewe kwega maheni oti re mo na viyo gira rada dikoishi tiga ora diyo ora de tuone jona na Jesus Christo Matthew twenty three Luke thirteen Luke seventeen Luke twenty one Mark thirteen that is the prophecy that we have for these days. Revelation, Daniel, those are our end time prophecy, and this is our end time prophet. Neni dauga, hibrani emwe, muhari emwe, auga atiri. Gayole amatu komatene. God in the same time who spoke to our forefathers by the prophet, have these days spoken to us by His own Son, Jesus Christ. Hebrews chapter one verse one. Ni atiri. Gayole awara gya na maide maitori. Lewa tuari idia na kanua ka amori. Atiri murata wa muadani. Gay aratuari idia na kanua ka Jesus Christo through His Word. Kanua ka muadani neke. Kiugo, todo ke beri kwa ri kiugo, na kiugo ari ngai, na kiugo to iri hari ngai. In the beginning was the word, and the word was go with God, and the word was God. This word is he who became the light of men. And without him nothing was ever made. He is the creator. Kiugo ke aga yushu no wara atu wale dia. Where do tike kohe ni andu? Waja kudaganya watu ki wabia ya ni nabi. Ati uri yabi wana, ume yabi wati supreme. Supreme na nani? Uri yabi wewe umekua supreme ume yabi wana nani? This time we are not going to, 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 to give a, a very soft message. No, 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 no. We are going to say as it is because we are Jonas. And Jonah does not give a soft message. No. Jonah tells people the truth. Come out of her, my people, or else you partake, this, you partake the sin. Hmm? Of her, you partake the, the, salary, the, the wage of her sin. Umai kuri kuendoa kwa mutikani tani le we ya wa babiloni. Gotire kuhudia na kuira dola. Ira doma mai we metekele marege mai karego ni neva iti mati regire neke. Nema meni le John alare da kiogo. Somebody told them. However, John alare kia kuta he kuoga ya yo karege ya kimuira John. Okera, okera second time. Okera odi ni neve ito alare ni nene. Okamba hujeriye, omere ate. Which is a great city that sits among the king of the earth? Tu avomo ole Revelation 18. Babylon, Babylon, itora, lele inene, lele maka gira, adha maki adhi. Atile rege ne morale menya. Lele atu e kirira wadha wako wa ya jumabiri. Nile yo lele kule hema wundu maya mothe. Nige dha anduwa the male merega. Atile e morata wamo adhani. Jona, Jona, okira tu anirire. This is no time to waste. Jona, okira. Dhiye nine ba, itora lele inene. Jona, this time da, da, aki ugara tikele dena. Ake gura tigiti. Gira meri. Ake gwa nine be. O ake roa terele. I get it ako 40 days. Told the ahead to 40 days. What is this with 40 days? Jesus, ara uma maine agadi wero ine 40 days. Akageri yone mo shuka ni agashoka. Mary, the koida to iria ara hudia. No je the koida to iria ara koma kafuri ine. The three days. Jesus wito ago kera ari kia kuma kafuri ine 40 days. Akaba tamatu ine. John ara uma daya kio go 40 days. Aka hujia three days. Negeva atweka ni itora. Aka kome terele 40 days itora le ninu. Ako ninu. No ni maja okire make ninu. Because God had an object reason. God wanted to ask to read. Nani kyo yifukuria jona tuwa deke iluo. Ihi daliri tuli ni ginya. Adoma okire ta jona. Do you see the gospel of jona? It's the same gospel of Elijah. Elijah is to the church. Elijah okire wele kanida atiri. Natuwe na Elijah's. And they are focused on the church. 
Na niyo mawa wakani na nitu leko huu. Niyo mawa era kanitha wa angai. Kanitha wa angai wa amati gari. Niku wadre da kuga. Ale ya mara amenyo adra uga. Nima amenyo adra uga. Kanitha wa amati gari. Niyo to meiru wa erija guotu ena prophet ta. Henrique prophet ta. Emanu wa otu ena Walter Fyth. Tu ena. Andu wa lea mara aliria kanitha. Maka mera tigai. 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 But we need Jonas. At this time. Maririe Babylon. Maume kuhuja ya kanitha. Maririe Babylon. Mamere umai kwa dua kwa. Na this time loud. Adunde mkuchu wakana marasho wakanerera. Adunde kuhugana marogana. Negeza matueke mahe maige. Na ni mahi hulete mahe maige. Nime kuhugwa dumeredi. Eni. Mwaro wa hitha wito wa tuwelete yo. Tuwale ikia kwa nerera dumeredi. Nyo ya mwraika wakana. Nyadwa ikimuno meku ma Babyloni. Adwa igimono meku ma Babyloni. Mashoke moeiti. Si adwa lea mareka ni dha maku. Mamashoke Babyloni. Todru wa adu nekohe tukana marahe tukana. Nehede kanidhora adho ugodhiyo. Nehede kanidha. There is shaking amongst God's people. And this shaking. Newe eno. And this shaking is being done. Some will be thrown into the sea like Jonah. But they are not going to become Jonah. They are kumiyoja. Na walea mai wetone Jonah mai gire. Because Jonah has to give this message. For three days. Listen what Jonah did. So, and Jonah began to enter into the city. A day journey. And he cried, said, yet 40 days. And he never shall be overthrown. So the people of Nineveh believed God and proclaimed fast and put sacroth and granted of them, greatest of them, even to the wrist. And the word of the word came up to the king and the Nineveh, and he arose from his throne and laid his lobe from him and covered him with sacroth. Setiri, na mali ya remi, maigua dumiriri, kai niyo ine mea kuigua, kengi wa wake rutaguo, ake huba, konia, ke haka, muhu. Jona ake ya terirazi kwa gedi ya ikoma handu, kamoteine, oje ya itora, tona, age ikara itora, leke ni noda kakoro wakua, age ikara asho udheridie. This is the time of Jacob's trouble. God is gonna save his own people. God will save his own people. God will use Jonah. Jonah was a prophet of God. Just as you and me, we are to be the Iranger and Jonas of today. We have to cry as in the Revelation 18, verse 4. Come out of her, my people. We have to be prepare our soul like Jonah prepared his own soul. For three days, Jonah did nothing other than to pray. In verses Jonah chapter 2 verses 1 to 10 Jonah is saying this Then Jonah prayed unto the Lord his God out of the fish berry And said I cried by reason of my affliction into Lord And he heard me Out of the berry of the shell I cried And at shell neko nege kuine De ku uwe kuine And gaya kigwa mwabo akwa ake jigwa De ku ukuri kumaine gaya kigwa no, Jonah didn't know he was in the belly of the fish. How would he knew? He was found himself in, the, and it was warm. It was really warm. The fish is warm, but God preserved. Then first you it's warm, but God controlled the temperature. He met Jonah, and when he came out, he was a little bit. Uh, he was more uh, light. And he was shiny because could, for three days his skin was being a little bit cooked. So he came out in a very different color. That is my opinion. Like anybody else who would be in the belly of the fish. And that people would see, why is this man looking like this? He was in the belly of the fish for three days. He refused, but now he came. And people preached. But Jonah told them, yet 40 days. Tolamu ira atirele, ugo tigetie meyaka menini jubiri ye kinye. Tolamu ira atirele, e tigetie meyaka mugu wanja. Tolamu ira atirele, mugu wanja, ni meyake tano na anudhu. Mara ya tuwe kirela dha ahari ya New York. Ira tohe te ginyadageka, the nego dira. Mara uga atirele, they have to do something before those years. But noni edeleta uko ira tuwe na meyaka mugu wanja jubiri ya aga ye kinye. E jubiri ya gana lea tuwendi. United Nation mara atu ira mena, Miaka etano by 2025 to ingine jubiri. What is jubiri? Jubiri ni mwakorea 
gai ya hura gari zeti baton au gitesi ya nesha israeli ni mudhe nya wakure kanera madhire ni mudhe nya wakuni ina madhe na mothe na migote shoka kanera yo ene ogu he mudu vei ni wadhi olela andu batiriri ni akuma he jubiri jubiri hivi ge heya nune mudu muru wagai mudu wagai jubiri can never be commanded by a human being it's God's command it's only God who can command the earth to rest for one year todu wala uga atiriri ni gamu he ilio maita meri mwaka waga tada tu nigeza mwaka kwa mungu wa jamu huruke na mutika huta mwaka wa miro gweta anori nika wa muhe ilio maitameri mwaka wa 49 nigeza mwaka ushio mkenere na mwaka ushio mwaka kanere madhiri na mwaka ushio mwaka kanere hido shia nyu todo ni nye jehova na mwaka wa mwaka shia kwa da mwuri le misiri todo mwudu if somebody buy you you are his property we are property of god na hivyo tole shia na shia ngai togo le tole ni thakame ya mwuri yo aga kuwa akare na tajona tadikiriri ya wana jesus ya kika tajona jesus ya uma in the presence of god ago wakanda ya nina aga shia ruo aga aikara agathinika agachoka agakinyaru agachirwo ringi ton muru wa mudu ni johana was jesus to be baptized what does baptism mean by the way iukaga nigukwa to kuwa kuma kwe mudu ya tuturaga nigetha tutuike mudu ngi what was jesus being baptized for jesus was son of god he had to become son of man how would he become son of man he was to be baptized nigeza umebere aga ya igire kure ya do na nikyo jesu wafati dhiyo da shoki na mochi andire wa eroi ni kugari yono mochi ukani agetuwe kada muabere aroma idha ano muhari wa idha adha tukinya wa inyanya mura tawangai let's read this together ni horomu dha kana ni horomu ya gagayu ya muwe wa rao taidia let's lead together aroma idha ano muhari wa idha adha tu amure hidiri ato watu hidetu wakete hii nyari o hidiri ya lea gerure ya kinya kristo ni ya kuile hidha nyari ito lea ando wa lea matate ya gagayu na lele, ni hinya modu etikere kura uo idhenyare ya modu uge onare mudhigu. No hii kwa hoteka kuoneka mundu uge omere liya kura uo uo idhenyare ya modu mwega. No lele, odo olea gai onanetie otwendi wake na guole ni uyu. Ate kristo ato kwele hile, lele ato ato hile tole ehia. Amen. Let me repeat that in English. Let's go together. It's Lohman. Chapter 5, verse 6 to 8. It's beautiful. Because this is how God showed his love to us. We are Ninevites. We were Babylonians. We were Gentiles. What did God do? Verse 6. For when we were yet without strength, in due time Christ died for ungodly. In due time, because the time was three days, four days. Jesus was to go to the belly of the fish for three days. For, sec for, hey, for scarcely for a righteous man will one die yet. Paradiventure for a good man, some would even dare to die. Not die, dare. But God commanded his love toward us. Commanded his love toward us. Do not get that. Hold that. In that, while we were yet sinners, Christ died for us. He did yet worry. While we were yet sinners. While we did know. When we were Ninevites. Jonah died for them. While they were sinners. Jonah went to the burial of the. While we were in the Babylon. Jonah. Do you know what? John says. The same John who wrote the book of John 3. 16. The first epistle of John. Chapter 3. 16. It is a parallel to John 3, 6. It says, for as God gave his own son and died for us, we ought to die for our brothers. How do we die for our brothers? By giving ourselves, by coming out, by telling them the truth, by sharing with them what we believe. I tell you, do you think it's easy? Do you think it was easy for Jesus? Hmm? It wasn't easy. Luke 23 verses 4 to 44. It was not easy. Tuka tika kukendagira wana yadu mahurile jesu mudha rapa iguru hale ya muhi yana nwa jesu. It was not easy. It's not a, 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 a sight to behold. Tibisha ajaka ya kutori ya hata yadu mahurile. No, God does not like to see it. He did not like to see it then. He did not look at it. Guy doni le muru ya mudha rapa ine. He moved his face. Gaide te kerele kono na muriyo, na gaide te kerele kono na mehia, ma kerele maemo ki ora ga muriyo. Hi na jesu wa kerele eroi eroi rama sabakitani. O diga neiri ya neke, gai wako. God does not like to see 
that and that picture we hang there please get it down don't put it there again don't show the son of man in agony again he is victorious he has raised he is raised from death he is not in the belly of the fish any longer dale mote ine ni aumete na aga komate ine di koitha tona kaliuka ora muona ni are mote ine ni ndwa kitu gani get him out of there please tafadhali look 23 verse look the other to come look 23 verses 40 jesus christo ni arera ni arera muno verses 40 era uga atia but the in uh, any look 23 verses 4 to 44 and other answering rebuked him saying does thou fear god the way am i going yeah because it's look 22 not 23 and it's what i'm talking about look 22 verses 40 to 44 and when he was at the place, he said unto them, Pray that he enter not into temptation. And he was withdrawn from them about a stone cast, and kneeled down and prayed, saying, Father, if thou willing, remove this cup from me. Nevertheless, not my will, but thine will be done. And he prayed again in agony, prayed more earnestly, and sweat was it at great drops of blood. That is verse 44. Today, in Matthew gives us the whole account. He prayed three times. Three times did Jesus pray with Father. If it is you, three times. Not, not that he did not love us. Jesus loved us so much. But this pain of death, separation from his Father, was too much. In Matthew chapter 26, my brother, my sister, Jonah was going through the same agony. He's leaving his country, going to a country that he doesn't know. That's why for three days, Jonah, but Jonah made the decision because God did not force him. He was formatted on the dry land and God told him, Jonah, will you go to Nineveh now? Wake up, Jonah. He is not pleading with him. Jonah, wake up, go to Nineveh, tell them this second time now. And Jonah woke up, bought the ticket and went to Nineveh. God will not coerce you. God will not force you. God will speak to you. Second time, even the third time, Jesus prayed with the Father three times. Matthew chapter 26, verse 37. And he took him, Peter, and two sons of Sabidi, and began to be soulful and very heavy, when he says unto them, My soul is exceedingly soulful, even unto death. Tarry here and wash with me. Jesus needed strength from his friends. He took the three trusted friends. Please stay with me. Hold me. I am a human being now. I'm going to be human. I'm human. 100% man. I have to die. They could not get it. Please pray with me. And he prayed. And he went one time, the first loud. He went further, fell on his face and prayed, Father, if it is possible, let this car pass from me. Nevertheless, not I will, but thou will. Was Jesus refusing to go to the cross? No. He's trying to see whether there's any other way man can be saved. Even though he is the very one that accepted, I will die. Now he looked at death. And he looked at the devil. And you know what the devil is about to do to him? And he is fearful. Omodo numod kedu kerekboya. Omodo wimwiri wiruo. Jesus ni amenya ruo ruo ya kuigua. Boy, fafa, utiri jire geto geka. Not where you are kwa. Let your will be done. Will wa ya gai reke guire. Ite directi thoma magaza fato kahiga mato. Gai ya ugete ni ginye amenya ruo. Oh na wa higa mato. Jesus wa rauga. Let this cup pass from. Utiri jire ge mudo yonia unire mana ni ma kwe mo de ikomi na ni ada vato ni ariha uga tagate na ni ado kete ya no ginya ago kuwa na todo mudo wa kuwa kuwa teni na teneri deke tomo kuire mo riyo ni goko riyoki I will raise you up in the third day like John I will take you out of the belly of the fish. Kwa mada ni ariha uga utiri kwenye ria kige tiga kia John. Do you see John now? Is that another type of Jesus? Is that type of Jesus? Typology? Do you see Jonah being assigned to Ninevites? Alaikyo hiria inekatate kandwa inge. 
akau maku agadhi ni neve ni neve ni gine to hujiri tiri ni murata wa mwadhani jesu wa kishoka hindari ya kere verse 42 he went again the second time and prayed saying my father if the cup may not pass away from me except I drink it then let you away okono gine adhi ni neve fafari eke gedhi ni neve otikiri nodo akishoka ali aga tatu akiwa tiri ni well, yeah, at that time, while we were 44, and he left them and went away again and prayed the third time, saying the same word, if your will be done. Three times, three days, three nights, three years and a half. Three, three, three. Three Murata wa Mwadhani. It was not easy for Jesus yet, but he took the will. That is what we call the offense of the cross, the agony of the cross that Jesus had to go through carrying the burden of the world, carrying all the sin. This is what John had to go through. Going to people who don't like God, going to people who are not Israelite, going to people who are Babylonian, and going to shout to them, the Revelation 18, come out of her, my people. Remember the remnant. Remember the remnant of the remnant you'll be saved. The ketoara, okay. Told him what I need to hold it. I told it, I told her, 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 because we are living in the last days. Now he didn't tell her, he didn't do it, 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 Let's call our brothers and sister. Dari ya nado, makajira uhoi, tutiwe mauduma ya tutire toa igua. Ando igi matire maigua. Nige shiri ya ite dune moe. Matiowe, jairo ni mwara wa hitha vitu wogi, tika kugane toe, tutiowe. Nde ma tutiowe ona, ni mauduma ma mwede oe. No ale umane ya terere. Ale ya toe, tuwe na haroe. Toto gainia ya tori ya terere. Why didn't you go to Nineveh? Na go, kere tiye ga koruta anda ya hake ongoyo. Kana ti korutu wa turute tu anda ya hake ongoyo. Kana koti yoke tege di igidhi ya murimo woka. Ngana wigo woka. Toka di igidhi ya tuara hoke. Okera hai, mwiri ya duhi da na ikinyo. Ndenda ku mwirate lele. Anavya shio maro woka maheni ku mwirate. Goti kwa gira, tafadhali. Ane anavya ya maheni liye mwanda maki za dakaya. Lele shia na shesira ili ato roba bironi. Ane anavya ya maheni liye adwa. Kristo liya jesu wa rachi ya ruo. Magetoma mwana wanga hii. Ake kumenyone ya do. Jesu ake ya buo mute ine kuwari. Nandu yanare ya tuwedi the whole of Israel. Ale ya masho kanere ile niyodo wake. Nare ketike kinya kukua na karioka. Tere morata wakwa. Waino wamo the go tika na atirere. Kahi wito ni ya tuwede ya temuno. Wendoji ya tuwede tena uoreke ya tutu waliri ya liyange. Wendoji ya tuwede tena uoreke ya tutu waliri ya liyange. Gotire mudo kahi ya redo olire babironi. Baberi nire kitiye kusha wakanirira. Oh, ni guwa horo wama. Kahi mutara yu uore ya kure eruo. Nwa yu uire olera uire. If kure ya olera andekiru wane ne Pope Francis. Rire to frateri tuti. Frateri ne brothers. We are all brothers. Frateri tuti it's all. Ne italiano. Frateri ne brothers. Tuti. Idu wade. Nero nire uborora ini lwa kore South Africa. Lwa eruo Jerusalem do kadige. Kutuara na to the Jerusalem. Eno ina ha de Jerusalem. Utri kodo godi yoni modu. Jerusalem ni goke goka. Jesu wa reketi ya goka. Dege dira. Ege. Jesu wa gyo kaidi tari ya gata to. And this is our be our next presentation. Toge doma. O horo wa ucho wa kwa Jesu. No horo wa goka. No horo wa miaka giri ya muge. No horo. Ule ya ego shoka. Oke. Dhuda. Jerusalem muwe goka. Dhuda wa adheno. Edikarete miaka giri ya tari modu. Tere murata wa muadhani. Dero nire uweboru. Nige da wone. The ninth week itekisha gike muwere. Sometimes. Modu ni onaga. Todo wa kuwa na doge menya. Tere uwa ruge to Jerusalem challenge. Dance. Ila iniru wone ginya Arabu. Na ohede. Na rachi ya kule ya kutoe gai. Utiri kuduru tana inuwa shareji yo. Ndege ukuonia the network itekisha gike muwe. Urava tara uwe kodu umwe uke nina merita. To the other nira aru merira. Le ule tuwe tere ile tuwe korona uwe ruti umwe. Githo omoke muwe. Ihoa ya mudhembo omwe. Juma pidi ye muwe ya wadhe ya duma hoe. Kwa nani ugo dhika nina kala dogo dhye. Nigo uwe kilo wadho negeza adheno. Ndega adhile. 
tondu ni ni gothira tiri murata wa mwana ni gutiga na gukwira tiri ngai ni akwendete muno 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 koda kwendete Jesu ndangiaririre maita matatu ni undu waku ni undu wakwa na nigetha ikuwa mudharaba ini na wedi wa ngai agikwitikira na riria kinyine mudharaba ini abuli na tiri undu ngi agikara hau ri ngai akihuguru uthi wake Jesu wake ona ithe ni heri uthi wake all this time god was with the father son God was with his son Jesus and Jesus and the father were one they could Jesus could see his father but when he was raised on the cross the darkness came he daria dumanere kinyete atumaga athira guke ni uramenya nduma yabageriria guka kahora 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 ni wale athu wa nduma tuikaga nduma olimwe yukaga kahora leu ni hindi turi tukugataga tiga tumakare ka rochini gukiroka gukea gutheruke jata ya eka wangai etwarire and we Jesus Christ tremorata wako ayi akurathime ayi agoikarie may the lord shine his face upon you may he give us power because the gospel that we are giving now is the present truth it is not the gospel that gonna make us feel so good no some of us are sticking their neck out ndutue ka tukurega go metwandu amwe ni marirego ona kuri mekuo ho ona kuri mekuvutwa wira ona kuri bara shaitani abiririe tiari kumahura na bara yone nene muno na ira ni bara ira hurwa na mahinya ma nduma tutekuona tiri murata wakwa nugu no ginya turugamire tukugitirwa ni Jesu Kristo ginya Jesu ashoke we haririe menyithio cionge wona ndumiririe no mekire thaini wa wa mshie subscribe hau dire kitu kikukohoya subscribe nigetha andu ingi muno mone muira murango uyu ukuhingwo wa kuheana uhoro na jira ya mutandao kai akurathime ndireke tuhoye hamwe wabadhi ni wale tona Jesu Kristo tuigwiretha ne hinda ria gutwara ndu mireli nineve babylon tondu nigo nigo itorere inene ne twikite gikarokia Nyoni yothe thuku that meaning the all the evil spirits are there that's why we have so many fake prophets calling them their prophets even using the very word that we cannot use that is only for you supreme god that is the name that we can't and they are using it to deceive many and they are enriching themselves father but your people love you they think when they give they think when they do this they are doing it to you so forgive us but open the eyes we have all been given time to power to make decision help us to decide to do the correct thing and to do the right thing bless each one of us all the reasoners and all those who are in vary of decision help them to make decision the time is too short and you are coming back tonight we commit our souls to you Give us rest until tomorrow. For this is our humble prayer in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you. God bless you. And let us meet next time. Please share.